Uh, Gina said that she took a, an Uber to work. Yeah. Yeah. This morning, and she was reminded, and I, Uber has like airport safety rules. Yes. I didn't. I had. I had no idea. What's that? When you're waiting for an Uber at an airport, I. Last time we were there, last time I was there, the guy is shouting all these safety rules that I had really? never heard of before. I, I had never heard that. Yeah. Like, we all know. He's like, okay, first things first. You check the license plate. We all know that. He goes, then, ask them for their name. Don't say their name. They already know their name. You ask them what their right. name is. I'm like, okay. That but makes sense. This one was crazy. Apparently... <laughs> You're supposed to be careful that when you get in, they don't put like the child safety locks on so you can't oh. get out. So he said the first thing you're supposed to do is shouting this at the airport in the Uber line. Wait, so the, are yeah. these Uber's rules? No, this was the dude was say, at the airport. I said that'd be yeah, really weird is... like if Uber had rules like, hey, <laughs> yeah, before yeah. you get in with one of our drivers, <laughs> yeah, right. uh-huh. make sure they're not going to lock is, you in and kidnap you. This is at certain airports. Okay. This is not everywhere. It's not every we report. Like, what is she talking about? It's yeah, an no, announcement this happened. or a live person. No, this is a live person. Yeah, I mean, yeah, it's, yeah, it's yeah. good. It's good rule of thumb. It's a great yeah, rule. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. this is the best part. He said, right when you get in, while the car is still parked, roll down the window, stick your arm out, and try and open the handle from the outside yeah. just to make <laughs> sure. And then, if you can, if you're comfortable, you know, and the hair can can take it. Leave the window down while you're driving. But why? Why the whole reach your hand out the window and try to open it from the outside? Because that's not the kid lock. The kid locks from the the kid locks from the inside. Right. The outside should be able to open all the time. Yeah. If you're waving to somebody and says like, "Let me out." Yeah. Exactly. Nobody says he wants you. Oh, maybe in case the kid locks are engaged. That You'll way know. you can reach out. No, you won't know by reaching on the outside. Again, oh, the right. inside's the only one that doesn't work. Right. You would reach to the outside. Yeah. And jump out. It. Just to make sure. You could work for TSA. Well, uh, no, thank you. Oh, okay. <laughs> those are, those you are your safety yeah. no, I, want to, I want to fly the planes. I don't <laughs> yeah. want to screen the people who are getting on the planes. That's true. Yeah. And by the way, I, I, I didn't do any of that this morning. Yeah. Oh, no. I took, a, I took an Uber in as well, and mm. it said, oh, your driver's name, Gore. Oh, oh Gore. nice. Yeah, he was from like Gore. Russia or something. Parts like unknown. This, this, never met a seriously, Gore. this guy looked like a like a bouncer at the Kremlin. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> he had this big like uh, chain medallion hanging from the, nice. the mirror. Uh-huh. He, uh-huh. Was, he was playing some music, mm. was in a language I didn't understand or couldn't even pick up what it was. Right. What yours was, your guy was playing music? Oh, yeah. Do very, you, very loud. Um, oh. When I was putting in my request... I said I prefer a quiet ride. Okay. Well, yeah. I always do that. It's super fun. And I didn't get that. But Aww. again, he looks like a bouncer from the Kremlin. Yeah, He's massive. Yeah. I'm like, You're not whatever you want, brother. <laughs> yeah. Which reminds me, I got a rate and tip. That's nice. right. He knows where you live. <laughs> yeah, right. For sure. Sort of. Kind of. Sort of knows. Uh-huh. I met him a little bit down the street. Smart. Uh, yeah. Yeah. My neighbors will get killed by gore. Yeah. <laughs> but, uh, it, it won't be me. Yeah. We <laughs> talked uh, a lot about, um, you know, people working at airports recently and and TSA. I just want to bring up this TV show that I just started watching. It's a Hulu original. It's called How to Die Alone. And oh, it's yeah. About, it's the trailer. Yeah. It's about a woman that works at an airport. It is super good. It looks very funny. Yeah. Uh, 940 says the reason they make you ask is because people are getting kidnapped because they're not checking the license plate. Yeah. My mother-in-law went to the airport and some random car <sighs> offered to give her a ride if she had cash. <sighs> yeah. That happens all the time. You just, I think my cousin and I did that once. <laughs> You, you we got in some random ass car that would oh. no because we were leaving a football game, and of mm. course it, it's packed. Or you can't get a yep. cab, you can't right. get, you know, Uber, or Lyft, or, you can't find anything. And so this one guy's like, "Yeah, you guys need a ride," and it looked like yeah. a private car service. Mm. We're like, "Sure." Mm. So I mean, we're drunk, and so we get in the car and we're driving. And my cousin looks at me, and goes, "Yo, dog." I don't think this dude's legit. I go, nope, I don't think so either, but it's kind of too late for that now, huh? <laughs> yeah, yeah we're going to do. And so my cousin lives in this very hilly area of Pittsburgh, which is all Pittsburgh. Right. <laughs> and uh, he dropped us off about a quarter mile from my cousin's house. Now, keep in mind, we're drunk, we're tired. Yeah, it's late. And we're like walking up these steep ass San Francisco style, like Pittsburgh hills. Uh huh. We were dead by the time we got to his house, but we didn't want this guy to know where my cousin lived. <laughs> but right we survived. Well, it's, but we survived. It's funny because before Uber and Lyft and all that stuff, MTV News did a story about people in New York that would just like oh, yeah. pick up random people. Yep. There's and, signs all over the airports yeah. Like yeah. In, in New York. 
cash and stuff. Yeah, and it's, it's illegal and, for them to solicit for rides. Right, yeah. right. Where but, you see that all the time in Vegas uh, because you'll have those like uh, limos or the big mm, stretch SUVs yeah. that are parked right by the taxi line, and the taxi guy will say, "Hey." We got limos available. Yeah. yeah. All and that stuff. They'll send you to those. Yeah. And those are just rando dudes. And yeah. then speaking of people getting the wrong Ubers, that just happened to Sammy and I. Uh, we were going somewhere. Oh, yeah. and, <laughs> and I go, I think our Uber just left. And some random guy got in the wrong Uber. Oh. And I go, well, I'm going to cancel on this guy. Because yeah. you can still cancel in the middle of the, right. of the ride. And then to notify him, like, yeah, wrong person's in the car. Yeah, dumbass. And so they had to come back. Yeah, remember, we watched him get in the car. We were yeah. like, oh, that's ours. Okay. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> no. But remember when we were in the Uber and Mike the Show Killer, like, we're on the highway and he, he actually canceled he it. canceled it. And the oh, Uber driver right. got so mad. He yeah, and got pissed. we had to pull over on the side of the highway to re request the car. Why yeah. did he do that? Because he's, he's a maniac. Just he's around. our word. Oh, yeah. My God. Sometimes. <laughs> Last time I was at the airport, <laughs> not I all could, the time. My Uber wouldn't connect to the network. Uh -huh. I just kept getting this big red X saying you can't get an Uber. And I considered doing what you were talking about, Wood. I thought I would just walk up to a random person and just be like, "Look, <laughs> I, I want get out to here. leave so bad. <laughs> yeah. yeah, what can I give you to give me a ride?" Now you said you requested uh, a quiet ride. Yeah. Okay, that's great. I wish you could request, and I never say anything when I get one. Mm -hmm. I don't need the clown car that shows up with all the special lighting oh, and that's all the <laughs> the disco lights. I, yeah, I, I would just rather 54. not. Yeah, I, I, I roll up in a, in a clown car, and this guy, the, those guys are always way over chatty. Yeah. And you know, I'm with yeah. you. I'd rather just have a nice, quiet yeah, ride, chill. chill. If we want to talk, maybe we'll talk. Uh -huh. Yeah, right. But, I'll uh, let you know. Otherwise, yeah, I don't. I don't and, need where the disco ball. And, and they have a the, whole the, like yeah. uh, convenience store inside of it. Yeah, too. there's gonna be like yeah. a couple skate. <laughs> Everybody clear yeah. the floor. Couples yeah. only. Yeah. Heart those shaped bed. <laughs> I yeah. like those. Looks like a Poconos resort. Yes. I never take the candy or the free water, though. Hell no. no. Nah. I was like, nah.